Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. So today we are doing another last chance video. If you do not know what a last chance video is, basically I hoarded makeup for some reason. A few years ago I started a collection back in 2015 and now I'm going on a low buy as of 2023. So I'm going through my collection and I'm pulling out products to use in my YouTube kit. And I pulled out a lot, and I don't want to put them back in my collection, so I'm kind of just like trying them out. I have this whole Last Chance series on my channel based around giving these eyeshadow palettes a one last chance to either impress me or it's time to find them a new home. So today we are going to be focusing on the Broadway Colors eyeshadow kit in Aphrodite. I actually have high hopes for this one. It's got more mattes to it. It's got matte that's a little satiny but I can still work with it and then another matte so excited but first if you are new here hi I am Kira and I am obsessed with makeup I am a mom to a two-year-old and a one-year-old and I work very hard to film videos multiple videos every single day and I have worked very very hard and tirelessly to post said videos every single day. So if you enjoy makeup content, then I have new makeup content coming your way every single day of the week. So you got a lot coming. And yeah, let's get into today's video. Okay, so if you are new and you don't know what my two or my last chance series is, it's a lot like my two looks one palette where I take a I take one palette and I try to make two different looks with it. However, this is going to be this palette's only chance to impress me, and if it doesn't impress me, then I end up finding it a new home. And I'm a little scared because these colors look extremely muted, even though I love cool tones. I'm not loving this color story, but we will see. Right. So I pulled out my Jeffree Star Magic Star Concealer in C0 to give which is the primer I use literally every day. It's a concealer, but I use it as a primer. It's a thing, but I'm trying to give it, I'm trying to give these palettes their chances. So I'm gonna take my Moda shader brush and just blend that out. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my Real Techniques 030 brush and I'm gonna take my Profusion Mattes palette and I'm gonna take the shade Heavenly right here. I love it. This palette, this is the perfect palette to like have in companion with other palettes. So I'm going to put this shade on both sides again to give this palette a fair and even chance. Super nervous. Okay. I'm kind of nervous because. I'm over two with this series, I'm not gonna lie. This is the third one, so we shall see. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start with this shade here. There's just not a lot of depth in this palette, is there? Well, this is the Aphrodite palette, by the way. Ooh, but that is mixing so well. I'm going to do this kind of satiny matte. Blend that in the crease. Ooh, this is mixing very, very well. I don't know, did we have a winner for once? What color is this? Okay. I pulled out the Jacqueline Cosmetics top coat in the shade Frozen to use, and I'm going to go ahead and put it down as a base. Though it's a top coat, I'm going to put something else on top of it because it's a cream shadow. Okay. You guys, I am excited. I think I have my first winner. I'm trying to Okay. I think I have my first winner palette in this series. The only problem that I'm seeing is that there's not a lot of depth, but no, we can make that work. I'm going to take this shade here on my finger. Ooh, that feels so creamy. It looks like it's going to match the Jacqueline shade very, very well. 
and I feel like this would be a nice combo for a chocolate smoky eye, honestly. Guys, I kind of am feeling this. I'm kind of feeling it. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my LMR Cosmetics brush and I'm going to take the light pink and put that in the inner portion. Even though it doesn't match, I just want to see how the shade looks. I'm going to take this white. And they are applying and blending. The pigmentation is there. I'm thinking uh, this might be the first winner. That's crazy. So, okay, I'm liking this look. I'm not gonna lie, it is a nice chocolate smoky eye. Y'all, yeah, um, like doing your lower lash line, a wa black waterline or a brown waterline, and a black line. Some nice mascara. This would be a nice look. I'd wear this out. I would wear that out. I would. Okay. Let's see. I want to do something with some depth. I want to try these dark colors because that's what made me get rid of the other palette was the dark colors just weren't there. So. I just think I'm going to go for it. I'm going to take this shade here even though it's got some glitter in it. It's got a lot of fallout, y'all like a lot like like watch that's a lot of fallout I'm not even pressing that hard that's a lot of fallout y'all like wow it's going everywhere let's see how this blends into the crease I kind of like that. I kind of like it. I'm going to do this shade right here first. It feels just as creamy. Look, look how pigmented that is. And I'm going to put this all over my lid. Take a little bit more because I have an idea. Oh my gosh, I like this so far. Like... I'm liking it. This is going to be a good palette for some smoky eyes, I'm not going to lie. Alright, no additional product. I just want to see how they blend. Okay, so that blended away quite a bit. That actually blended it away a lot, but that's not unusual for a shadow to like a dark shadow to get blended like that and blend away is not unusual. Okay. okay. That's not bad. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this black. The only thing is that I'm finding that these palettes have a lot of this palette has a lot of fallout. Taking this black on the outer edge and into the crease. Oh my gosh, I'm liking this a lot. Okay, I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I'm done. I'm keeping this. This is a really good palette, in my opinion, for some smoky eyes, and I'm excited to have this. I can't believe it. We are one out of three. <laughs> so, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So please like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell. All that social media great stuff if you really enjoyed this video and you like makeup content. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video because I gotta be. Right. Bye y'all.